Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Joffrey Noodle Legs here today with another um, rehousing. Today we are rehousing a jumping spider that we've received from uh, Jeremy of Jeremy's Wild Worlds. Now if you haven't checked Jeremy's channel out, please go and do so. Amazing little channel. Anyway, he sent me uh, a jumping spider. Um, it is a... A um, Phidippus Regius Rest Rastafari Blue female. So I don't know the size of it or anything. It's still in its container. Not had a chance. So we're going to rehouse it today, and we're going to pop it into one of these um, amazing little containers. Let me get it in half from uh, the the um. The uh, spider shop. So this is the container that's going to be going in. Should be fine because these are made specifically for things like jumping spiders and things like that. And little sling like uh, um, Caribbean Versa colours, things like that. So we're going to just do a little little setup for it. Um, so we're going to be doing it in... Uh, this is spider life. Don't need too much substrate, to be honest. This should be all right. One more little bit in there. There we go. Bit of spider life in there for it. Um, this one I'm going to put cork bark in with. I've got a nice piece of cork bark. Which is nice there. See if I can just get that to stand up there for me all right and a little bit of the fake planting as i always do let's try and pop this in there as well try and see if i can pop that underneath the soil um give me a minute guys while i just take this off camera because it's too fiddly to try and do it around the side of the of the camera so there we go that's in there now a little bit of substrate I do have a little pot a little um water bowl which i will try and squeeze in there if i can just push it down there we go uh here we go see if we can get some water in there There we are. I'm going to put some water on the leaves as well. And this should sit on top of here very, very nicely. Let me have a little look. Yeah, that's okay. I'm wondering if I could put another, um, something else in there. Just a little bit higher. Let me have a little think. Let me have a little think, guys. This is what we're doing. We're playing around with it. Because we want to get it right for the little baby. I'm wondering if this stick would sit in nice with the cork bark. Let me now see if the lid fits with that in there. It should do. Again, I'm just taking this away for a minute, guys. I'll pop it back in a second. Yeah, it seems to fit in there all right. Lovely jubbly. So, there we go. That's the little setup for the baby. Little tiny water bowl down there. Not too worried about the water bowl because I'll be putting water like on the leaves um, and stuff. And I also put a little bit here on the top. So it's got a few drops to sort of like have a little drink if it's thirsty. So all we've got to do now is the hard bit. And let's try and move the spider over. So let's do that now then, shall we? Well, like I did the other day when I had the other jumping spider, I um, did it in this container. Just in case the spider wanted to come out, it can hang around there for a little bit. And it gives me the opportunity to sort of like... Uh, check it all out and everything 
Just make sure I've got everything close to me. I need me a uh, tweezer. So what we're going to do is try and get the spider into this bit. And then I can pop that bit on top of the other bit. So it's going to be strange because I'm doing it around my mobile camera. So give me a, a moment, guys. going to take the little lid off. All being well, the spider's well. Like I said, I've not seen it yet. But fingers crossed. It's doing well and it's in its little, hopefully, in here in one. So if I can try and remove the whole tissue. There we go. That's the tissue out. Now all we've got to do is try and locate the little baby without it tearing off. Oh, it's a lovely little thing. So it's out and it's in the thingy there. I know you can't see I'm off camera, but I do have it contained in that um, nice uh, half of the uh, thingy. Let's line this up and I'm going to try and bring it over without disturbing the spider too much. It is in there. Just got to try and line this stuff up. Pop it down for a minute, Joff. That will help you a bit more, mate. Line it up, mate. And we're trying to... Give me a second, guys, while I'm lining this up. Yeah. Because I want to make sure I'm not hurting the spider or nothing. Here we go. Uh, it's not in properly. Now it's on. So it's in there somewhere. So all we've got to do now is just try and locate the little baby. So let me move this out of the way. I'm going to move that. Pop that there. And we're going to have a little look, see if we can see the spider. So the only way to do that is put on a bit of light and we can see if we can see the spider anywhere. Yeah, it was little, little little thing it was. Oh, there it is. Down at the bottom, see him? Uh, so we've located it let me pop it down and see if we can zoom in a bit so that it's in it's a little home all happy hopefully having a drink because I did put some water on there and yes I can see it's having a little drink already I'm trying to see if I can pop this at a better angle for you to see it because it's quite a little little baby so what I'm going to do and do is raise this up here and we'll come up here and we can try and see if we can see through the glass there There we are, all rehoused, lovely. I believe it's just having a little drink. Beautiful colorations. Thanks, Jeremy. Beautiful spider, mate. So this is uh, another jumping spider. I will look into it more for its uh, common name. I'm not sure. I know the other one that I got from him was uh, a Florida jumping spider. Not sure about this one. Um, but I will do my utmost to find out. Absolutely beautiful little thing. There we are. Hello, baby. 
you're in the noodle room now. Absolutely stunning. His name is Cassandra, Cassie. I'm going to call this one Cassie because the other one is Rodney. So, Cassie! Cash. Absolutely beautiful little thing. It will settle into its new home. These 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 containers are absolutely perfect size. Um, all of this on here is just a bit of water that I've sprinkled in there um, for the little baby because I thought well it might be well thirsty after this journey. Absolutely stunning. Thanks again, Jeremy. So I'd like to thank Jeremy of Jeremy's Wild Worlds. Check out his channel uh, for this beautiful spider. Thank a few other YouTube channels out there. Uh, Mark the Spider Guy. Spider Mum 1978. RS Designs. Unusual Pets. Unseen Universe. Incredible Inverts and Other Animals. Tina Deep Blue Sea. Scott's Inverts. Dave's Little Beasties. Tom's Big Spiders. All amazing channels, guys. Just trying to. I'm so sorry that I'm. Because uh, because I'm holding the tripod in my hand, it's a bit wobbly. Trying to get as close as I possibly can for you. I love its coloration. It's like a little bumblebee. It's so cute. But anyway, that's Cassie. So she'll settle in, and we'll let her do that. I'll let her settle in for a day and then I'll drop in a, a tiny micro cricket. See if she's hungry. Thanks for watching guys. Until next time, look after yourselves. Look after one another. And I really hope that I see you all soon.